hello everyone my name is arohi and welcome to my channel so guys in my today's video i'll show you how to use yolo v8 on jetson nano using deepstream so let's see the modules which we need for this tutorial first let's check the python version python version is 3.6.9 and then let's check the cuda version cuda version is 10.2 now let's check the deep stream version so i'm using deep stream 6.0.0 for this tutorial and then now let's check the tensor rt version tensor rt version is 8.0.1 okay now let me show you the jetpack sdk on which i'm working so here you can see okay from here also you can see the cuda version tensor rt version open cv version which is compiled with cuda python version is this and then jetpack sdk is 4.6 okay now let's start with our today's tutorial so first step is to clone this github repo so guys i have prepared this repo and you have to the first step is to clone this github repo and the code of this repo i took from this repo so this is a very good repo and over here they have shown examples with different yolo models so i just took the code which is related to yolo v8 and created a separate repo over here and then i worked inside this repo so first step you will do is to clone the github repo okay once you clone the github repo then you have to paste yolo v8 s.pt model yolo v8 s.onnx model yolo v4.waits file yolo v4.config file in this repo let me show you so here this is the cloned repo in home only i have a cloned repo open this repo and here you will see yolo v4.config file yolo v4 wait file yolo v8. Uh, this onnx file and this is yolo v8. pytorch wait file now how you will get all these files let's see all those things first step is here come here you will write these three lines and these three lines will give you yolo v8 s pretrain model in pytorch format and this line will give you yolo v8 model in onnx format okay and to run this code you need to install the ultralytics package first now you will paste these two uh, wait files in the in this directory okay next thing is this file and this file so i have given the link in description section and you can simply visit those links and you can download these two files from there now the next step is once you have this next step is to compile the lib so to compile the lib just open the repo again this and in this repo you will see this folder open this folder so when you will open this folder you will inside that you will see multiple files and one of them is make file open this file and we will make some changes in this file in order to run the code correctly so how we will open it first just enter in the this is a repo we have entered in that and inside that we have another folder this and inside that we have make file right so here inside this we have make file now here it is now we will run sudo nano make file and hit enter okay you have to enter the password and this is our make file just scroll down keep on scrolling and in here okay is here so you have to check the path of deep stream the deep stream version which you have installed you have to check the path that uh, you should have mentioned the correct path over here so in my case my deep stream is installed over here in computer and then opt nvidia deep stream deep stream 6.0 right so this is this is the path of my deep stream so that's what i have mentioned over here right so then scroll down 
and in this line also you will also check the path of deep stream and that's it guys this is the only change and then control x you will come out of this file now we will run the compilation step and to run that compilation step you first need to come out of this folder and then you will export the CUDA okay so our CUDA version is 10.2 so that's what we have written over here and then we will run the compilation step so I have already performed it but still I am going to run the code for you so compilation is going on okay so compilation is done now the next step is let's go to the repo again here yeah here now we have to open this file config info primary yolo va.txt file we will open this file okay so we have this file over here only okay just this is our repo and here config info this this one okay we will open this file and here we will check that this is the path of our model yolo va.onnx file okay so if you are working with some other models you will change the path over here then we have labels.txt file number of classes are 80 because guys we right now i'm showing you how to work with the pre-trained model and yolo v8 pre-trained model is trained on yolo v8 pre-trained model is trained on coco data set and coco data set have 80 classes so that's what we have over here and then that's it okay this is the thing which you need to check and if you have some other model or the number of classes are different then you will change make those changes over here after that next step is to edit the deep stream app config file now let's open this file so deep stream app config okay open this file here you have to make sure that you have provided the path of yolo v8 config file okay this path okay let's copy it from here and then we will paste it here now save it and now let's run it how to run it this is the change we have done these changes now the final step is to run to test the model so to test the model we will run this command over here 